Welcome back to Indian Times Daily. The top 10 headlines from Punjab are a total of 56% of registered voters exercised their franchise on Wednesday in the by-election to the Gurdaspur Lok Sabha constituency. Minor clashes were reported between Congress and BJP SED workers in some villages in which 5 to 6 persons were injured. The Haryana Congress has passed a unanimous resolution seeking the elevation of Vice President Rahul Gandhi as a party president. Nearly 200 newly elected delegates endorse a resolution for Rahul Gandhi's elevation. Kamil Nath termed the resolution as historic. A Punjab woman has accused her employers in a Saudi Arabia city of physical abuse and has expressed fear that she might be killed. In the video that has gone viral on social media, she has appealed to the Aap Sangrur MP Bhagwat Maan to rescue her. CM Amrinder Singh has requested Union Finance Minister Arun Chetli to allow Punjab to swap the high-cost loans from the NSSF and market with low-cost market borrowings. The state is seeking to restructure its debt after being burdened by its spiraling borrowings and interest liability. The NGT has directed Punjab to bring 21 farmers before it on Friday. This is to test the state's claims of having supported these farmers to manage stubble in a sustainable manner without burning. The Enforcement Directorate has raided the house of PCS officer Anand Sagar Sharma, accused of the multi crore Hoshiarpur land scam in Patiala. The case pertains to the acquisition of 103 acres of land for widening of National Highway along the Hoshiarpur Chitpurni Road. The Ludhiana Police has nabbed Shiv Sena, Hind leader Rohit Sani, and five others. This is for cooking up threat stories to seek more security for himself and his brother in law. The Punjab government is initiating a project to integrate its online land revenue services. All land records which are already digitized except for a few villages will now be available on a single platform and will be updated simultaneously. Punjab has failed to lift restrictions from a large area near Rajpura imposed under the Prevention and Control of Infectious and Contagious Diseases in Animals Act 2009. Six months ago, the area was declared bird flu infection free. Actor Amol Parashar is set for his first stint on television in and as Gabru. He will be seen playing a Punjabi hip hop king Gaurav Singh Akka MC Mani as part of the series which charts the journey of Indian hip hop over the past 6 7 years. I'll be back. Stay locked on to IndianTimesDaily.com as the news from Canada and Gujarat follows.